Hello everyone, welcome to Homespun Recipes. I am Karishma, your host with yet another recipe. Today I will show you the recipe of delicious drumstick and potato curry. But before we get into the video, I would like to request you to please subscribe to my channel and if you like this recipe, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Let us see the ingredients now. I have taken tomatoes, 2 medium sized ginger garlic paste, 3 tablespoons, 3 medium sized onions, jiska paste bana liya hai, green chilies 2 to 3, 5 drumsticks, uh, this is also called murunga, munga or shiunga, 2 large sized potatoes which I have diced, cumin seeds half a teaspoon, garam masala powder half a teaspoon and salt according to taste. Coriander powder 2 teaspoons, turmeric powder 1 teaspoon, red chilli powder 1 and half teaspoons and 1 teaspoon of cumin powder. So now let's start making our drumstick and potato curry. I have taken a pan to which I am adding oil and once the oil becomes hot I will add cumin seeds to it and allow it to splutter. Let the cumin seeds crackle and then add in the onion paste. Fry the onion paste till they become uh, brown in color. The onions have been frying and now they have become slightly brown in color. So now I will add in the ginger garlic paste. Stir in the ginger garlic paste and fry the masala until uh, the raw flavor of the ginger garlic paste is gone and then we will add in the powdered spices to this. These are the spices that I have taken, uh, red chilli powder, coriander powder, turmeric powder and cumin powder. Fry the masala nicely and keep stirring occasionally just to ensure that the masala does not stick to the bottom of the pan. Now I'll add in the salt and garam masala powder to the masala and uh, then I will add in tomatoes to this. Now we'll give it a nice mix, add in water to the masala and cook it really well. After adding water, I will cover the pan and cook the masalas. Now let us check the masala. Uh, yes, it is uh, nicely cooked. You can see that the oil has separated from the masala and the tomatoes have become soft. So now we will add in the drumsticks and the potatoes to the masala. In goes the potatoes and now I will give everything a very nice mix so that the potatoes and drumsticks gets coated with the spices and we will fry them for a little while before we add water to this. So we will fry this till uh, the masala becomes dry and the moisture is gone. And now I will add in the green chilies to this that I have slit. Fry this uh, for about 5 to 6 minutes till the time uh, the oil separates from the uh, vegetables and the spices. Now I'll add water to this, uh, about one and a half uh, glass of water will be sufficient for the drumsticks and the potatoes to cook. After adding the water, 
uh, just give it a nice mix and cover the pan and cook this curry for about 20 to 25 minutes in low heat. The curry has been simmering for about 20 minutes now and now let me check how it looks. As you can see that the uh, this curry is almost ready but it still needs to be a uh, little more on the thicker side so I will cover it and cook for some more time so that the water content is reduced and the gravy becomes thick. So the drumstick and potato curry is ready. You can serve it hot with some chapati or fulka and even with boiled rice. It tastes amazing. So try it. Hope you like this recipe and if you do like the recipe, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. You can click on my picture which you can see on the screen and you can also press the notification bell which is right below this video so that you don't miss any of my recipes. Thank you so much for watching Homespun Recipes. You take good care of yourself and I will see you in my next video.